Hello teacher, my name is Ken. Today I'm going to talk about an important chance that my classmate had. But before I start my classmate story, I'd like to introduce a little bit of information about her. She uh, was an officer and worked for the People's Committee in four years. She uh, was an extrovert and loved to communicate and help people. Besides, uh, my classmate still enjoyed working outside rather than in the office. She said that she had a modern job in the office and the salary was so low that she could not manage to uh, keep herself. Her life was really a disaster. You know, while many people were likely suspicious of change and they were open to resist. However, um, my classmates uh, were not one of them. She was positive and seemed to uh, welcome the change. She chosen to change and created her own life. I could show her uh, confidence in the decisions and had a positive thinking of good results in the future. She uh, told me that after a few years thinking carefully, uh, she decided to study abroad. So um, she applied for a full scholarship of the Australian government. You know, uh, when I was chatting with her uh, at that time, I thought this chance would give uh, her a great opportunity to learn new things and grow personally and professionally. Uh, she was in um, luck, um, so um, lucky luck uh, smiled at her and uh, she got the scholarship. Although uh, she was so happy to get this scholarship, she was in the face of dilemma whether to stop the job or not. If she uh, decided to study abroad, she uh, would lose the, uh, the job and what she put a lot of effort to build in um, the office in four years. But my classmate had a decisive choice was study uh, abroad. Furthermore, thanks to uh, the support from her parents, she was strengthened pursue her dream. Although um, there were several uh, new challenges ahead that she uh, might uh, met, I thought that uh, she uh, would conquer them and achieve her goal. Uh, yet, I asked her uh, about the quotation that she loved about change. She uh, said it from John Kennedy. American resident is that change is the law of life and those who look only to the past or the present are certain miss the future. Um, I uh, asked her again uh, why she likes this quotation. She said that this quotation motivated and inspired her to change and she believed that change was something that would certainly happen. Immediately um, she told me uh, how to deal with this change. So um, there, there were three ways uh, to, cope with, to cope with the change. First of all, um, I needed to aware apparently uh, that changes always happen. And in Lee, uh, implementing change is never painless. Secondly, uh, I need to eliminate uh, the fear of change because I didn't know uh, what the result of the change was. Last but not least, I need to uh, be confident to go ahead with enthusiasm. This advice is 
are were so uh, beautiful and helpful. I I, I think um, it would uh, I would learn from it and apply apply it in my life. And maybe one day in the future, I will get uh, a payout for myself. Thanks for uh, that's all for my story. Uh, thanks for listening.